Yes. Um, along with the presidential <clears throat> campaign. Um, I think this district has four, it's, it's president, it is state senate, it is and state representative. So, oh, and, 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 and Congress, U.S. U.S. Congress. Yes. So there's four elections going on November 8th. Yes. Okay. And so yeah. um, for those uh, who don't know you, tell us a little bit about Paul. My name's Paul Sherrill, and I live over in Sparta, White County. I was born and raised over there and raised on a farm, and uh, my wife lives and my son lives. Um, we live in Sparta there, and he goes to school at White County. And her name is Miranda Sherrill, and I was a police officer over in Sparta there for over 10 years. And and uh, my wife and I, we do some real estate together and, and buy and sell. And I, I'm a past owner of auto parts business, uh, construction some and that we've done and still do. And now at, uh, my wife and daughter wanted me to be home of the night instead of out there being in the patrol car. Now I'm out in the political field trying to get elected to state representative in the 43rd district. Grundy won in White County. So what led you to that decision? I feel strongly this is what the good Lord above wants me to be doing in my time of life, and I hope that that's what I'm doing in my time right now. What, um, so if I did, you know, session starts in January, what do you see as some of your priorities? Well, as talking with people from uh, the 43rd district, which Grundy and Warren and White County, Grundy County is uh, different people as, uh, as I've met with, just like this past Monday night, met with some men here in Grundy County, and they have a concern about needing industry in Grundy County. And also, uh, these men brought up to me the concern of uh, problem with illegal drugs in the county, that uh, from the state level, what can we do to help in these situations? And, uh, and if, hopefully, uh, and I believe I feel good about it, elected and go to Nashville to represent the 43rd District, we will see what we can do to try to help bring in people that will help Grundy County fight drugs and uh, try to uh, see what we can do to try to help bring in industry in this area. So. What um, <clears throat> what do you see as potentials for this district? What other pet projects do you see for your district, which is Grundy, White, and Warren? Well, there seem to be always a need for um, our morals, and it don't matter where we're at, okay, the moral issues. And we have a lot of good people in our district, the 43rd district. So. In our country, we look at the country. Moral issues is a big thing that people is, is brought to my attention. You know, they see our morals going down. So hopefully we can take better morals to Nashville to represent our 43rd district. Roads is a big thing that uh, has been brought to my attention in the 43rd district in places that uh, the state highway department, they need more help here to try to help improve roads, and state roads, county roads. Um, Teachers, our education system. Teachers are critical. We need education. We need to support our teachers. We need to support our staff. We need to support uh, the students, you know, so we can have good education. And, and if you have a good education, that helps you to future yourself in a better job. So. All right. So um, <clears throat> you were talking about the Defense of Marriage Act on the break. Tell, tell me why that's important to you. Yes, back in uh, 2006, over 81% of Tennesseans voted that marriage is between a man and a woman. And that's according to the Bible. Well, then we come along later, and now the, the, the U.S. Supreme Court has overturned the, the uh, Marriage Defense Act. And there was six of us that was in Nashville back in the earlier part of the year. And... Um, as the uh, legislature there was meeting and the Senate was meeting, and they was wanting to try to uh, pass a bill that that's how we stand on it. Tennessee stands for marriage between a man and a woman, okay? Six of us went from our church up in Sparta, Tennessee. We went into our representative's office, which is uh, the Democrat, uh, Kevin Dunlap, and we asked him how he uh, felt about this bill and if he would uh, support it. And he said, I'll have to study about it. Okay. 
marriage is between a man and a woman. We don't have to study about it. The Bible says is marriage is between a man and a woman. There's no, no studying about it. We need to stand up for this. It's time that us, the people, takes a stand, you know, for people. Marriage between a man and a woman. And he is uh, a Democrat. He's supporting Hillary Clinton. And, the, and the, we know that she is not for traditional marriage. She's, she's for abortion. And he's, he is a Democrat that votes with her. He's standing with Hillary Clinton. And yes, I am standing with Trump. I believe Trump will be good for us in our country, especially when it comes to electing or appointing these Supreme Court justices. We need people in the U.S. Supreme Court that will take a stand for our Constitution that our forefathers fought for us. Very important, critical. This, this presidential election is probably the most uh, important critical election that we've ever had. And, and ever who gets in there and as president will appoint them Supreme Court justices that will either say marriage is between a man and woman or they'll say that anybody can marry anybody or anything. So I believe that if uh, we as a people will elect Donald Trump, he will have put people in there that will be good for our country. And I support him. And I know that Dunlap, my opponent, he supports Hillary Clinton. He supported Obama. And look what a mess we're in. Folks, please. Let's send people to Washington and the state of Tennessee that supports our values. Well, um, all righty then. Now, voting, <clears throat> that's coming up. Uh, that's coming up. Yes. How do they find out about Paul Sherrill, and then what should they do if they feel strongly like you do? Well, we have a website, uh, and this is uh, my card that I've tried to give out to a number and number of people, probably seven or 8,000 cards that I've given out to people. My name is Paul Sherrill, and you can uh, go on Paul Sherrill for uh, 43rd District State Representative. And also, my home number is 931-935-8488. Please give me a call. I will try my best to return your call. I'm not home right now. But if you'll leave a message, I will try my best to call you back and, and, and try to help you with whatever situation it is. And my opponent... And I've been told from a number of people that they have tried to call him Dunlap, and he will not call people back. Folks, I will try my best to call you back. All right, so be it. All right, well, we're going to send um, uh, state representative candidate <clears throat> Paul Sherrill on his way. I think we can also find you on Facebook. Right? Yes. Um, early voting starts next? 19th. 19th, that's yes. coming up. Yes. And then the big election is November the 8th. Yes. So what is your advice to everyone? Please, I encourage you. It, it is your responsibility, my responsibility, American people, especially the Christian people. If you're a Christian person, please go vote because this is a critical time in our election that we go vote because it's going to determine for years ahead of us what's going to be for our children our children, our grandchildren, because when these Supreme Courts get in office, they're not there for four years or eight years. They are there for, for life or till they die or whatever. It's critical because they make a lot of decisions that happens in our United States. Amen. <laughs> All right. Well, um, we're going to go back. Thank you so much. Thank you, Ms. Thank Always you. good to have you around town. Thank you. Um, we're going to take a break. We're going to get Misty back with us and uh, grab some coffee and uh, go back to our regularly scheduled program, buy, sell, trade. Um, we got a bunch of people from Sparta calling. Good day. Yeah, we yeah. got some good sell, buy, sell, trade items. So good. anyway, um, take a break, grab some coffee, and we're going to see you all in a minute.